Hello, 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 beautiful people. I love you guys. Thank you for joining me. I am, I hope this is not too loud in the background. I am currently on my way home. Just finished my trip to uh, finish the reconnection level three training. So I'm now trained to do the personal reconnection, which I'm so excited about. It's been exactly two years since I first got certified to do this work, which means I've been doing this work for over two years. Because I started in January of 2019 offering uh, distance sessions to people. Uh, just to, to, to test it out, to learn, to try and see how it worked out. And if you followed me then, then leave a comment because you're one of the uh, original OGs of the channel here. <laughs> I, um, I did 10 free distance sessions for the first 10 people that reached out to it. And uh, it took like a month, but I got 10 people and did 10 free sessions. And uh, with some people, I did multiple sessions and it blew my mind. It blew people's minds. We had healings. We had people getting back into balance people waking up and changing their lives just a lot of amazing things I've witnessed since that time uh, just miracles and it's nothing short of miracles this energy is just it's a miracle and you can do it too everyone has access to these frequencies anyone can do it if you believe you can do it point you in the right direction anyone literally anyone can do it so that, the whole reason I, I started filming just now is because I'm driving to the airport and I've just been thinking about my life and how much I genuinely love my life and what I've created for my life and all the people and relationships in my life I am super grateful for it and I just love my life. I love what I've created. I love it. I absolutely love it. I'm more excited to go home to my life than I was to come out here. And I was super excited to come out here. Because I, I, I love to travel. I love to travel. But I think I like like driving more. Because flying spending eight hours in an airplane this isn't real exciting to me you know driving at least you can pull over and get out and stretch your legs or get something to eat if you want I mean I just whatever I mean I, I'm super grateful that this trip all worked out too I mean I can't even it's such short notice and, and it was a divinely guided trip I can only that's the only thing I can say that and I'm pretty much an expert traveler now because I was able to put this trip together in like 30 minutes and then you know figured out all the other pieces to it that I needed to over the next day but yeah if you aren't happy with your life if you then you're not like you're not accepting where you are in life now and you're exactly where you're supposed to be in life. Otherwise, you wouldn't be there. So accept where you are. Because where you are in life right now, it's perfect. It's beautiful. Maybe it's not where you want to be, but it's where you need to be. It's where you're meant to be. And I accept that. And I know, you know, I have goals and I have plans especially with this healing work in the future that I really want and would love to have now, but I'm okay with it not being here right now because I'm working towards that goal. And the way I want it to manifest in my life is going to be in a grand fashion. So it'll come when the time is right, when I'm ready for when the world is ready for it. And when that is what I can do full time. Because that's always been the goal. But I also really.
really love my job. Like, I'm excited to go back to work. And I work like 70 hours a week. And I used to use that as an excuse or, um, like, man, I love my job, but I just work too many hours. But when I'm there, when I work 12 hours a day, my day goes by fast. And I enjoy the people I work with. Like, I enjoy being around them. And I enjoy talking to people. And I enjoy selling cars. And it's really not even about selling cars. It's all that happens, it does on its own. So really, I just enjoy talking to people. Helping people. Because that's what I do all day long. I'm not a salesperson. I am... I'm a problem solver. That's what I do good in life. I'm good at solving problems. So it's only natural that I would do it all day, every day, and get paid to do it. It just happens to be that the end result is, you know, selling a car, which is fine with me. Because that's what I know. It's what I'm good at. I mean, I can sell anything. I'm choosing cars because... I like it, and I like cars, and I like having nice cars, and I like driving nice cars, but anyways, we got off topic here, just wanted to say, be grateful for your life, love every bit of your life, be excited for your day, no matter what it is, if you don't like your job, <clears throat> accept that you're there for a reason, to Oregon. oh, I'm in Oregon now, accept that you're there for a reason, and if it's not what you want to do, what are you going to do to change it? You're there for a reason, so you're still in a, maybe a disbelief that you can't succeed in life doing anything else. That, that's a possibility, or you're scared to step out into the unknown. Trust me, the, the best things in life are in that unknown. It really is. The most exciting things most rewarding things you can experience in this life are when you step out into the unknown. And just surrender. Surrender to the universe. Trust that the universe always has your back. Because it does. Especially when you trust it. When you trust it, you, you can fully surrender to it and allow the universe to, to, to bring those things into your life. Whatever it is. Whether it's a new job, a new partner, a new whatever, whatever it is. You set that intention that you want it, and the universe is going to bring it to you. It's just a matter of how much are you resisting and not allowing the universe to bring it to you. I can name like a handful of things in the last year that I just said I wanted, and within two weeks, I had it my doorstep for free brand new and that I you am know, the only thing I did was set the intention like oh I'm gonna buy this or I'm gonna get this or I want this and then you know I meet someone a week later that knows someone that's giving away exactly what I was looking for for free it's brand new you know or finding the house that I wanted and it just popped into my reality through a person that I met and just happened to start talking about a place to live and boom there's a house that I'm now living in just effortlessly you know the meeting and the green and everything was just effortlessly that's how I live my life effortlessly I take action but I allow the universe to bring things into my life effortlessly because I don't Whatever I want, like this house, I wanted the house, but I wasn't pressed to move. I really wanted to move, but I didn't need to, which is a great situation to be in. Yeah, I'm so excited, and it's it's interesting to me. I woke up today, and usually the last day of your trip, you're like, oh man, you know, I gotta go back home, back to my life, blah, blah, blah. Like when you're coming off a of vacation or going home from vacation, you know, it's like, I don't feel that way at all. I'm just as excited, if not more excited, to go home than I was coming out here. And that's fascinating to 
me. And that tells me that I've truly built a life that I've wanted, that I love, and I love every minute of it. And I'm excited to go back to it. I'm excited to go back to work. I'm excited to see my kids again. I'm excited to, to sell cars. I'm excited to help people through their problems. I'm excited to do healing work with people. I'm excited to do, ooh, who's gonna do, who's gonna be my first personal reconnection client? That's what I wanna know. I am so excited about this. I've got it down. I've got it down perfectly. And it's, oh, I can't wait. Oh yeah, and side note, I've had like nine personal reconnections facilitated to me this weekend. I don't ever recommend that for anyone unless you're crazy enough to learn it and want to be a facilitator uh, then you're, you will experience it and it's wild after the first day of training I went home and I didn't even eat dinner like I couldn't even I was trying to mess around with this new gimbal I got um, for my phone and I couldn't even do it like I was my legs were shaking my knees were shaking I just had to go to bed I was so wore out it was crazy but anyways i'm rambling i love you guys so much this is my view in oregon right now beautiful out here i don't know if you can see anything or not but i hope you could i love you all i hope you got something out of the video be the change that you want to see in this world i love each and every one of you bye bye